Hi, you might have seen a recent video where I um, had issues with uh, what turned out to be my uh, Tigano microscope, we think. I th originally thought, I discovered this on a live stream, um, usually every Saturday, by the way, I have a live show if you want to come hang out. Um, we discovered that, we originally thought it was a Blackmagic ATEM switcher problem uh, where we're getting uh, flickering and um, all sorts of uh, issues with uh, the image uh, coming from the Tagano microscope. But uh, after further investigation, it looked like it was probably the Tagano microscope. Blackmagic did have an investigation into it and they couldn't find anything. So anyway, I contacted uh, Tagano and uh, they said, um, like, I can't do any firmware upgrades to it because mine was like one of the original uh, first batch production models or something uh, like that. It, it's the Tagano Zip. Um, it's upside down so all the electrons are going to fall out and so I couldn't do that and um, so the only way they could try and do something is to actually replace the board in it and I said hey can you ship me a new board and uh, at first they wanted me to um, buy a new uh, board from them and I said mm -hmm. You gave him the microscope for zip, so ha, see, zip, ah, mirror all week. Um, so look, just send me a new board and I'll install it, and uh, you know, hopefully, Bob's your uncle, right? And they said, Oh, no, we can't do that. Um, so uh, ship, ship the microscope back and everything. So oh, I ship the microscope back, and um, yeah, it's been a couple of weeks, and they've finally shipped it back. And here it is. Um, I've cut it open, but I haven't taken it out yet. I assume that they replaced the board in it. Um, it's got they've got a new box though, but that's probably um, a I don't know, they might have sent me a new one. I have no idea, it's supposed to be fixed. Um, so let's have a look. Um, okay, I've got a, um, that looks like a real super duper um, HDMI cable. I did not ship that with it. Um, so it's all the new packaging. So let's have a squiz. And unfortunately, I thought I took a photo of the serial number of my original one. And there you go, there's nothing else in there. So it's not, so yeah, it doesn't seem to be like, like a new factory fresh product um that kind of looks like mine let's have a squiz where on the bottom so i'm assuming that's mine that looks I, yeah yes that is definitely my original lens so they have sent it back there you go um if you don't know there's just a uh, a times four uh, lens on this thing. I can actually put a times 10 I do actually have a times 10 lens somewhere, but my old firmware did not support um, The changing of this lens I couldn't even get into the menu and I thought I originally did but apparently uh, You can get into like a menu where you can set all the you know the uh, the frame rate and everything like that um, And the and the lens magnification and stuff, but I couldn't get into it So that's one of the things that I wanted the uh, the new board for so apparently they have uh installed a freshy new board on there. I think I might have had um, some dodgy contacts on the, on. I can't remember whether, yeah, I think it was the USB uh, on there. And um, so, you know, but you know, I could do that. Anyway, you can get HDMI out or you can get uh, USB 3 um, out and I stream it both ways, but I just uh, use the HDMI because it goes into my ATEM switcher. There's the control interface and everything. So yeah, cool bananas, they've sent it back. Um, so I'm going to go install this and uh, try and reproduce the exact same problem. Let's go. So I just shot this entire video um, and my audio wasn't switched on. So I'm going to have to do it again. So sorry you missed all the excitement. <laughs> all the excitement is, is that um, it, well, a, it, it does the thing now, and you can, uh, sorry, you can't see behind my head there, um, but it has a new magnification thing, which actually shows 1.7 times. It actually shows the times. It can go right up to, I'm zooming all the way in, zooming all the way in, hang on, I won't spoil it for you, uh, 30, 52.7 times. Um, but that depends on the lens magnification and uh, the monitor size and stuff like that. Anyway, it does actually um, do, it, it works again, um, but unfortunately, it's, um, it's not solved the problem. Spoiler alert, watch this, the exact same board. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Ta-da, flicker, flicker, flicker. Ooh, I haven't seen that one before. That, that didn't come up before. Yeah, flicker, flicker, flicker as I overexpose this thing. And this is using that new supplied HDMI cable I got in the box. I also tried it with the original one I was using, which is, has the, which is the original one supplied, which has the Tagano label on it. Um, and uh, yeah, and it, it does the same thing. So it's not, so for all those who thought it was a HDMI cable, it is not that.
So at great expense, I shipped this back to Denmark. I don't want my Danish viewers. Um, and <laughs> they installed a new board. At least I've got a new board, um, which, which has the new menu. I should try the menu feature. What do you do? You hold it. Is it hold down the center button or something for five seconds or something? No, that's auto exposure. Oh, there you go. That's supposed to be a menu. There. There. Yeah, I've got the new menu. This did not work. On the, I, I'm sure, actually, I do remember seeing it on my previous one, but I could not get it, like, just before I send away. I could not get this menu up again. So, yeah, now, now it works, right? So, anyway, this is default out of the box. Uh, yeah, so you got to set in your monitor width. So, if you set in your exact monitor width, if you set in the close-up lens, which is uh, set to four, which is times four lens, as I showed you under here, um, I can change that, and then the uh, magnification will match then the you know times 1.7 x magnification will actually um change that so yeah cool huh <laughs> i at least got the menu system now yeah so i don't know what color boost is uh osd timeout that's fine uh it's set to 60 frames per second 1080p so that's that's what i had before um by default what white balance is auto no, it shouldn't be the white balance, surely. Um, picture flip, no. Um, so anyway, well, let's let's turn color boost off. I don't know what color boost is, but who knows? Uh, that could change the color space, uh, which is what um, Black Magic were talking about. Because back Black Magic, uh, they did actually their technical team tried to contact Tagano, and I was in the email loop on this, and they were asking for you know what color space do you use, the HDMI specs, and everything else. And as far as I know, Tagano did not reply to them. So eight, uh, so Black Magic are not able to do any more investigation. They've gone well, you know. Look, <laughs> uh, but well, no, I'm sure this is what they're thinking. Um, is that well, no one else has complained about this HDMI capture thing, so it, it's just you. So the smart money um, seems to be on a non-compliant HDMI output from the Tagano. That seems to be the smart money. So anyway, let's let's exit this, shall we? Save and exit. Boom. Whoa. <laughs> it, just, it just zoomed me back out. That that wasn't me. Cool. <laughs> okay. Let's let's go back in. Let's see this color boost. Was it was it the problem with color boost? Nope. It ain't color boost. So there you go. I don't know. I might make turn color boost back on. I want my vibrant colors. Um, is that any different? Anyone notice any anything different? But anyway, this is my magic board that can make this overexpose and do this problem. And yeah, it's it's still there. So at least I got an updated board. At least I can get my menu system, which I couldn't get just before I sent it away. But I'm sure I originally had it. And it doesn't have that stupid hex magnification anymore. It actually says mag. Now it's, you know, it currently says like mag 8.x times. So that that's at least better. That's improved. But no, still there. So wah, 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 wah. Catch you next time.